Hey everybody, welcome to Adventures with Peps. Today we are unboxing a Zapdos EX collection set from Scarlet and Violet 151. Now 151 is my favourite set because it obviously takes you back to those early Pokemons, the Kanto vibes and all that wonderful stuff. Right, let's see what we got in here. I found this randomly at Walmart. It was the only one on the shelf so I thought I'd treat myself. So we get a foil promo card featuring the Zapdos EX, one foil card of Electrobuzz, an oversized Zapdos, four Pokemon booster packs, and a code card. Now right, let's get into it. God, the glue on these. Ridiculous. Good job I'm not a, a box collector. All right. Get rid of that. Crack this open. First of all, I never keep the code cards, so let's show that one off. Whoop. There we go. Enjoy. Let me know if you get something good. I guess it's probably just the uh, Zapdos cards. So there is the Electrobuzz. Very nice card. Hope this is not like pinging the microphone too much. I know it can be annoying <laughs> hearing plastic crack and then a super shiny Zapdos card or Zapdos card. Hang on, we're gonna zoom in a little. Whoop. Get that focus going. Look at that. So shiny. Love it. Then we have the oversized card. I never keep these. Goes to my kids ultimately. They love them. And I can see why. It's nice shiny. Look at the shine on it. Little uh, stars. It's very nice. Right, and then we get the four packs. Yeah. So i to change up my focus again. There we go. We'll start with the first pack. Now, I was a big uh, Squirtle player. I have not got the Blast Toys yet. There is the code card. And we have a Lickitung, a Venonat, a Pidgey, a Metapod, Graveler. Protective Goggles, whoop, Arcanine, great Pokemon. I had the blue, yeah, I had the blue Game Boy. So uh, I was not able to get this, I had to trade with my friend to get him. A very nice looking seal, <gasps> and a Mr. Mime. Oh, and a Wigglytuff, and an Energy. Look at that, we just got a double pull. That Mr. Mime is amazing, I love it. And the Wigglytuff. He's so shiny. <laughs> oh, that was great first pack. Let's move on to the second one, see if the luck can continue. Like I said, this is my era of Pokemon for definite. So I love all the cards in this set. There is the code card. We get a Krabby, a Sandshrew, there's something good at the back. A Seal, does every pack have something good? I don't know. Dudo. A Fero, Onyx, used to love Onyx, Dragonair, Weeping Bell, a Polyrath, looking very cool there, a Shiny Raichu, and, oh, a Shiny Energy, wasn't expecting that, that's a very nice looking energy, and a very nice Raichu, not as good as that first pack. Hopefully that's not my best pack. Hopefully we didn't do the best pack first. Right, pack number three. Let me know what your favourite Pokemon is in the comments below. Always interested to know, code card. We have a Caterpie, an Eevee, Grimer. I used to love Grimer. He used to be in my uh, main lineup. A Weedle, a Tentacruel, another one that always was in my lineup. Hitmonlee. 
This is some great ones. Oh, Wartall. Then we got a very nice looking Pikachu card. Followed by oh, a Tangler and a Vile Plume. Very nice pack. We're still on that first pack being the best one. The fourth and final pack. Hopefully we get something good. To be fair, I'm happy with my Wiggly Tough EX and my Mr. Mime. <laughs> they are by far the best cards. A Caterpie, an Eevee, a Grimer again, a Weedle again, a Graveler. We're getting a lot of doubles on this one. Protective card, RK9, a Kabutops, very nice looking card, a very shiny Psyduck, and oh, Valplume again. Energy and the Code card. Well, that wasn't a terrible run. I'm pretty happy with this guy. I love a Kabutops. But yeah, first pack had the winning cards. Mr. Mime and a Wigglytuff for the win. Let me know your favourite cards below and I'll see you next time. Cheers for watching.